People were rushing to get out of the fire zone. Reporter Jennifer Kastner caught up with some of them before they hit the road. The Zwart family is quickly packing up and moving out of their home that's in the fire's path, while the sky behind them continues to fill with dark smoke. We're, we're, we're doing all right. I'm loading it up. What do you want to say to everyone out there? Just evacuate. If they tell you evacuate, leave. Yeah, don't stay. Just go. I'm sad for my sister. She raised six kids here, and, you know, it's scary. When it gets this close, horses are being taken away. Today, so far, we've gotten three, four trailer loads of horses out the emu, the duck, the donkey, and now we got a call for 17 more way up in, in, the, in the, the canyon up here. Although most are evacuating, a few, like Dave Rogers, are choosing to stay. If I got hose strung out to the house, fire hose, I got a tank up there. Uh, I'm going to stay here and fight this rascal if I can. A few miles away, cars are lined up on the roadway, fully packed, heading off to safer land. In just the last couple of hours, evacuation orders have been expanded as a wildfire in Monterey County now continues to spread. It's destroyed six homes and two sheds. The burn zone stretches through Garapata State Park. That's just north of Big Sur. Firefighters say 1,600 homes are in the path of the flames, and people should be prepared to pack up and leave even if they're not in the mandatory evacuation area. We just want people to be ready and prepared. And the reason for that is, is we want people to get all their important things in their vehicles. So when they actually get a phone call or the sheriff's department comes and tells them to evacuate, they just need to get in their vehicle and leave. Crews from the Bay Area have traveled to the area to help knock this thing out. And so far, they say it's only 5% contained. Here's a satellite image over the area of the fire. You can see the smoke drifting to the northeast. 